Is it possible that AI could replace software engineers? Absolutely. The tech landscape is rapidly changing and if you want to keep up, you have to jump on the AI train. I've been hearing so many people ask the question, is AI going to replace software engineers? Is AI going to replace programmers, UIX designers, teachers, cooks, life? AI has existed for quite a while now, but I think more recently with the rise in popularity of ChatGPT, it's kind of just gone beyond what any of us would have ever imagined. Before ChatGPT, most of the AI exposure that we had as a collective public was Siri or Alexa or Google Assistant. And these AI powered assistants were very limited in their capability, meaning that they were designed to help you within the software operating system in which they existed. ChatGPT, on the other hand, is a general purpose language model that can generate a response to a variety of different prompts and questions. And I think people started getting into a bit of a frenzy when news began circulating that it was passing all of these advanced tests and certifications like the bar and also passing the technical interview for a entry-level software engineer at Google that starts at $183,000 a year. Since the announcement of ChatGPT, there has also been no shortage of AI tools, whether it is a new feature in an existing tool that you use or a new tool in general. And to be honest with you, I don't think that it's all bad. This recent AI craze has led to rapid advancements in AI technologies that has helped us with mundane tasks like driving, even though that hasn't really caught on yet. We have autonomous vehicles now, but also when helping with some pretty complex tasks such as detecting early disease. But on the other hand, I recognize that there's valid concern with job displacement, ethical concerns, regulatory challenges. And I can make a completely separate video about regulatory challenges as well as ethical concerns. Leave a little emoji in the comment section if you're interested. But in all, all in all, I'd say that the main concern that has everyone kind of up in arms right now is the concern around job displacement. In particular, software engineering jobs. And I'm going to be completely honest with you, I'm not going to sugarcoat anything. Is it possible that AI could replace software engineers? Absolutely. However, I don't think that we're there just yet. Well, AI technologies offer a lot of help and a lot of benefit in its current state. I think that it's being used more widely for mundane and repetitive tasks. Within the space of programming or coding in particular, that could look like bug detection, language translation, code completion, and in some cases, even design feedback. But even still in doing those tasks, I will admit that a lot of the time it's pretty impressive, but there is a percentage of the time where what it spits out is completely wrong. And in order to know that it's confidently wrong, you as a software engineer would have to understand the code, you'd have to understand the language, you'd have to understand the application, the workflow, why it's wrong, why it doesn't work for your use case, meaning that your skills are not obsolete because you would have to lean on your training as a software engineer. In addition, software engineering is a lot more than just writing code. It requires a deep understanding of the problem domain, context, knowledge, collaboration, and we aren't at the point just yet where we can say that AI can confidently do all of those things. So I think that even though it looks a lot different than Siri, AI in its current state can still be thought of like an assistant that's there to help and aid you. With that being said, moving forward, AI is going to be entering our lives from every corner and you cannot fight against it. You have to embrace it. If you see a new AI technology that's being offered in a service that you already use, my advice to you would be to go and learn how to use it because it's not going anywhere. It's just going to continue to get better and you have to move with the train, not against it. So even though I've stated that AI is not going to be replacing software engineers anytime soon, I understand that there still could be concern around if it's still a good time to get into the industry. The way I see it, if there's any indication that you should get into tech, it's that AI is increasing at the rate at which it is. The world we live in has become increasingly digital and software is an integral part of all of our lives. You can give me any industry and I would be able to point out to you where they're utilizing software within their business workflow. And if that's not enough to convince you, the US Bureau of Labor Statistics has stated that the employment of developers is projected to grow 22% from 2019 to 2029, 
which is way faster than your average for most occupations. And I understand that with tech layoffs, this can be a little bit discomforting, but you have to understand that there are highs and lows in whatever industry you go into. Overall, if you're interested in becoming a software engineer, I would not allow the AI frenzy or tech layoffs to deter you. So in conclusion, is AI going to replace programmers? No, at least not for now. Thanks for sticking around. If you enjoyed this video, I urge you to subscribe and leave a comment on what I should talk about next. Also, if you're interested, make sure you connect with me on Instagram and TikTok. I'll see you guys later.